Climate change is real. The climate change. The climate change. The climate change. Australia has a lot to lose from climate change, yet most Aussie blokes just didn't care. I don't give a f about global warming, no. we're getting pizzas. Even the Prime Minister, a known I climate change sceptic. The climate change science uh, is far from settled. But there is one thing Aussies do care about, their beer. So one leading craft brewer decided to do the unthinkable, to brew a beer that was undrinkable. We called it Drought Draft. So now Australians could taste the effects of climate change. Crops essential to making beer are falling victim to climate change with farmers warning extreme heat and erratic weather will lead to a lower quality, more expensive product. So the quality of the beer really starts at the farm and obviously any, any climate change uh, will have an impact on the quality of the barley which in turn will have an effect on the quality of the beer. What we did was try and mimic some of the conditions in the event that water was less available some of the ingredients would be, would be more scarce. The end result is the beer is probably more dry and a little less flavoursome. It's not a great beer um, by any stretch of the imagination. Our advertising medium? Something thousands of Aussie beer drinkers look at every day. Beer taps. We put drought draft in some of the country's most iconic pubs and gave people a free taste. It tastes like salt water. Nah, it's got nothing. It tastes like what I imagined this would taste like. <laughs> As word got out, Aussie beer drinkers became climate change activists. There's no beer. And to make sure their message was heard, we let them give a shout for the planet donating the price of their beer to the Climate Council, Australia's leading climate change lobbyist. After growing public pressure, in November 2015, the Australian Government finally agreed to sign the Paris Climate Change Accord. We can't claim all the credit, but we're glad we helped get the message out. Cheers to that.